Barbie's friend PJ. Wouldn't it be terrible if all your friends were the same? Imagine having a group of friends who all looked and acted exactly alike. It wouldn't be very exciting. <laughs> My idea of a good group of friends would have to include as wide a variety of people as possible. It's a big world. And not everyone looks, dresses, or talks like you and me. Some people's way of life may seem a little bit curious when you first meet them. But once you take the time to get to know them, you'll find that beneath the customs and the clothes, people really are the same in most ways. They all laugh and cry and love their families and friends just the way you do. Oh, sure. <laughs> Their appearances and ways of life may be a little different from your own. But I'll bet that once you get to know the real person, you'll find you have a lot in common. Besides, there's nothing wrong with differences. I've heard that no two snowflakes are exactly alike. And I'll bet it's true for people, too. I don't know about you, but I'm glad we're all different. It's one of the reasons the world is such an exciting place to live. Thank you for being my 
met some of my friends. I don't mean to brag, but I think they're the greatest. And we work hard at keeping our friendships going strong. Let's talk about what to look for in a friend. It's simple, really. You'll want someone you feel comfortable and natural around. A good friend should like you for who you really are and not for how you dress or what you own. It's important to share things with your friends, too. But your friend should respect your privacy and understand that you can't always be together. You need some time for yourself as well. And remember, the things you look for and expect in a friend are the same things they will be looking for in you. Oh, that's right, Ken. Friendship is a two-way street. It requires a little give and take, but it's worth it, believe me. Because if you and your friends work together, you can create something beautiful. A friendship that can last your whole life through. Confessions of a Doll Collector's Daughter. You can go on my blog, also Confessions of a Doll Collector's Daughter, or you can leave comments below, and I will see you soon. Bye! <laughs>